Okay, so here is the control board. This is a control board for a forced air heater. And what has happened is water has somehow dripped on the on the heater. It could have been through a flu, flu duct that was leaking on the roof. And uh, the control board got wet, basically, somehow or another. Uh, the heater was mounted underneath the house. So basically, somehow or another, uh, water possibly came in through the flue and got on the board. Now this board, I don't know, it looks like a pretty old board. Um, it does have a number on it. This number here, HH84AA0009. And then this, this number here, 8625 CFR. Um, so basically, this control board, of course, a, a regular um, regular HVAC person may tell you, well, this is an old board. We, 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 can't, we don't have a source for it, brand new. So basically, we can't do anything. So we have to get you a whole new heater, a whole new forced air system. Because we can't source this board brand new. It's too old. So then you're looking at like what? Three three to ten thousand dollars for a brand new uh, heating system? You no, know, that's what happens. So if you can't source this board brand new, you're a regular whatever, HVAC dealer. You know, you have to tell the customer, hey, we have to install a brand new heater. You know, so, and this actually could have been prevented. Um, it's likely that some, some uh, vent had leaked on the roof. Um, some flue had leaked. And so, yeah, that's your HVAC story for today. <laughs>